Hello and welcome back to Summit Railway. Today I'm in the basement hallway to assemble some flex track I bought recently for the Garden Railroad project. Let's get right into it. Right here we've got 15 times 2.4 meter long flex track profiles and in this box are the sleeper sets and we have to assemble them. Here we've got one sleeper set. As you can tell, they are fixed only on one side of the sleeper, which allows them to flex like this. So when we go to assemble that flex track and you want to bend a radius later on, it is important to line up all the um, fixed sides together. So later on the track will be able to flex in one direction. And now we can go ahead and just slide the track profile in the slots. Just like that. And if you slide on 26 more pieces like this, you've got yourself a fully assembled flex track. And that is basically the whole procedure to assemble a flex track. Easy, right? Before I start doing this 14 times over again, we quickly should talk about why to use flex track opposed to the pre-manufactured track pieces you can buy in the store. Reason number one. Every track connection point, which I will do by using the muscled screwing connectors, is a potential derailment hazard and is a potential electrical issue. So by using such long track pieces like this one, you can get rid of many track connection points and such reducing the amount of potential errors. The second and most obvious reason, because this is called flex track, uh, is that you can bend your own track and curve radius and you are not bound to a fixed radius you can buy in the store. You can bend any radius you want. So that's a really big advantage over the pre-manufactured tracks and to bend it the right way you have to use a um, bending machine but that will be for another video when we are out in the garden laying the track. Today is just about the assembly. So now that you know the two reasons why I use flex track for my garden railroad project, it is time for me to assemble all the other 14 pieces I bought. And I hope you have gotten some good information out of this video and we will see us on the next project. Bye!